fascinating says a metallic library door is made up of a rectangular frame with a semicircular shape on top the height of the frame is 2 meters and this width is 1.4 meters what is the area of the door now before you can solve this question you must be able to sketch this now since it's a rectangular frame this is what our door looks like okay then on top there's a semicircular okay so now notice this is a 1.4 and the height is what 2 so if this is 1.4 you should notice sorry this is also 1.4 and this is the center of the circle of our semicircle so for us to find the area for the rectangular for the rectangle the area will be 2 times 1.4 which is what 2.8 meter square now for the semicircular um, object on top shape on top of it for the semicircle the area will be pi r squared all divided by 2 okay so this is for us to solve this we are going to get the area of the circle and divide it by 2 so it's going to be 22 over 7 times now our radius is uh, 0 0.7 that's times 0 0.7 that's 0 0.7 square times 1 over 2 so this is the same thing as uh, 22 over 7 times remember 0 0.7 is what 7 over 10 times 7 over 10 times 1 over 2 so here 7 is going to cancel 7 so we are going to have uh, 2 here it's 1 and 2 here will be what that will be 11 so this is going to be 7 will be 77 over 100 which is going to give me what 0 0.77 meter square now to get my total area total area will be area of rectangle plus area of semicircle which will be 2.8 plus 0 0.77 so I have 7 here um, this is 5 plus 1 and this is 3 meter square so the correct answer it's uh, D so we will go to question 19 question 19 says the area of a right angle triangle is 24 cm square the height of the triangle is 8 cm what is the length of the longest side now all we need to do is draw this triangle okay it's a right angle triangle that's the first thing you need to know so it says the area is 24 cm the height is 8 so we are trying to look for here x so the first thing we will do um, since we know the area that's area is something as half times base times height so since we know the area we need to get the base now this will be 24 is equal to half times b times 8 this will be 24 times 2 is equal to b times 8 and b is going to be 24 times 2 divided by 8 8 here is 1 8 here is 3 our b is going to give us 6 so our b is 6 now using pythagoras theorem x square is equal to 8 square plus 6 square so my x square will be 64 plus 36 x square is equal to 100 therefore our x will be square root of 100 which will give us what 10 cm the correct answer here it's going to be what c question 20 says a square base tank of side 4 meters has a height of 5 meters the tank contains water to a height of 2 meters how many liters of water is required to fill the tank the, your ticket to answering this question is all about understanding the question the first thing you need to understand is it's a square base that means the length and the width are the same so we have the height now also it says that the tank contains water to a height of 2 meters so that means the volume will be what since it's a square base is the length times the width because it's a square times the height it can contain 4 times 4 times 5 so 4 times 4 
times 5, that's 16 times 5. So when you multiply 16 by 5, you are going to get the, um, 5 times 6, that's 0 carry. 5 times 1, it's 5. Plus 3, that will be 8. So this is 80 meter cube. Now, volume of water in tank. Now, since it contains water up to 2 meters height, it will be what? 4 times 4 times 2. That will be 4 times 4, that's 16 times 2, that's 32 meter cube. Now, how many liters of water is required to fill the tank? That means if this is the amount of water in the tank and this is the total capacity of the tank, so it will be water to fill the tank will be 80 meter cube minus 32 meter cube. And that is going to give us 48 meter cube. Now, in order to get it in liters, you need to record that if 48 and um, 1 meter cube is equal to 1000 liters, 48 meter cube will be 48 meter cube multiplied by 1000 liters all divided by 1 meter cube. Meter cube cancels out meter cube. So you're going to get a final answer as 48,000 liters. So the correct answer here is going to be what? C. If this is your first time of coming to this channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to click on the notification bell so that you can get more videos from us. Please follow us so that you can get more KCP videos.